Uh, I don't know how good this video will be, but this video is just to show the people that has a Ford Fusion on how to remove their, I call it a dome light. Uh, I've heard people call it a map light, whatever you want to call it on it. So what you want to do, I use a latex glove so I don't get dirty hands and oil all over my nice tan interior. So the only tools you'll need is just, I used a flathead screwdriver as you see here, just like so. And what you want to do, what I found best is I went over here and you kind of see a little bit markings, it'll rub off. I started on this side here and kind of give it a light firm pull downwards. And I worked my way over here and gave it a light firm pull on it. And you want to be careful because this is plastic and you do not want to break the housing of it or the clips. I do not recommend pulling on this piece here because all this is, this is attached to it, but all it is is just melted onto it basically. I'll show you what I mean once when I get it off. So like I said, just kind of shove your screwdriver through here and just give it a light, full, firm pull just like so. I was able to just do that with one hand. Then since I got that side down, I'll go ahead and start over here on this side. And just kind of do it just like so. Then I'll take both my hands and kind of work my way back a little bit and give it a, a, a firm pull onto it, both my hands on it. I don't know if I can do it one-handed or not, but I did, like I said, both hands kind of pull downwards. Don't just rip it off. Kind of give it some little slack and wait kind of shake it and pull for it to pop off then off it goes now the clips like I was saying what I started over here is because of these clips here then I can slide my finger back here but this is this is the harder one because it's got the metal clips one here and one there then you'll got some on the back right here and one right there and this is what I was talking about don't pull on this because that's all it is I just kind of melt it onto it. Then to disconnect it, you got the tab here, push in and pull out. Same thing here, push in and pull out. I'm not needing to take mine off just yet. The reason why I'm showing this video, since I'm gonna you know, take it apart, might as well help other people that's needing help with this. I'm planning on installing one of those steel plates where this will light up. If the camera will focus. where this little plate here will light up. So like this piece here is, uh, I believe it's like a chrome piece and this, the word fusion will actually light up when I open the door and it'll turn off when I close the door. So I will make a video on that whenever I get that in the mail. I will make a video on how I'm installing it. So basically just uh, take this one off, put your new one on and you'll have to wire it up. So the way I was planning on doing, it's just going to where the door is at and find the door jar switch for the power of it and do it that way but it seems like it's going to be a little bit more complicated doing it that way so i'll have to just feed the wire up on the pillar to the dome light so and once you want to go ahead and put it back in just vice versa all i just gotta do is make sure it's in all the way i start from the back and give it a good firm push till it snaps in place but before you just start smacking it, make sure your clips are lined up into its hole. So like I said, I just started from the back, pushed in, then go ahead and push it in, and there you go. And you're all good to go. So that's how you remove the dome light on a Ford Fusion. Thanks for watching.